Welcome back Minties to Near Me Condition, a channel where you can be part of a positive, honest community and lay claim to some comic book knowledge. I'm your host, The Astonishing Melanie, and today we're going to geek out over the complete year one uh, deluxe hardcover edition of Doctor Who by Titan Comics. Please stay tuned. Thank you to the folks at Titan Comics for sending us this review copy that is oversized and hardcover as I mentioned. So here is a size comparison. So you can definitely enjoy the artwork that is uh, created by many artists in here. It collects the first three volumes of the 10th Doctor Adventures. So again, here is the spine and we have the same image from the front here. Um, on the spine and here is the back. The cover artist is Alice Jung and she did a terrific job of capturing the beauty that is David Tennant. The side profile, the just slightly must hair. Here's a look at the binding. It is sewn. That's a pretty good eye right there that is. And there is no slip cover. This is how you receive the book which you can find for, um, even though it retails for $50, you can find um, on cheap graphic novels for percentage off for $35 instead. I'm gonna be using my trusty sonic screwdriver spork for this review to help me out here. To point out right here, we have the writers, um, Nick Abadziz. He writes the, the first and third um, stories with Robbie Morrison doing the middle one. And those are The Three Trades, Volume One, Revolutions of Terror. Volume Two, Robbie Morrison's writing The Weeping Angels of Mons. I was so happy to see the angels back. And Volume Three, The Fountains of Forever. Like I said, many artists and colorists, and it's interesting because his new companion, Gabby, is an artist, so sometimes the art changes because it's her drawing the pictures. So this takes place, um, it picks up after Donna Noble is traveling with the Doctor No More. That's all I can say in case you haven't read it, um, or I'm sorry, or watched the show. Um, I don't want that to be a spoiler. This is going to be spoiler free, just a little overview here. The new companion here is Gabby, and this is her friend Cindy, who, of course, if a companion has a friend, it's going to show up later, right? She shows up in the um, third volume, the story that's collected in here. But Gabby, I like Gabby. She is, um, she's very responsible. She feels uh, responsible for working at the laundromat. She has a lot of pressure from her family, her father. Um, even though she wants to go to college, she wants to be an artist, she wants to write stories, and this is just a lot of fun waving this sonic screwdriver around. So, of course, she runs into the 10th Doctor, and I'm pretty sure 99% does he say, he says, take my hand, all oh, goosebumps, can you see the goosebumps? Probably not, but those of you who are fans of the show will know what I'm talking about, yo. So the first story I like, I'm not saying it's tame or anything. It doesn't need to be drawn out. It's not that convoluted or deep because it's introducing to us Gabby as um, a character in the new companion and you know, who's the doctor and such. Um, it reminds me of like the mannequins um, when the doctor first meets, the night doctor meets Rose, the mannequins, you know, coming to life kind of thing. The spirits fe feeding off of negative energy and you got the positive energy ones and their sounds and just in general, that's what it's about. All the artists do a terrific job of capturing David Tennant's facial expressions, which of course is really important, right? Because they're so iconic. Um, I mean, yeah, that's perfect. That's him. So like I mentioned before, my opinion of Gabby is I like her because she has a good heart and she doesn't give up. And of course she's smart. Here's her artistry because she can't like, you know, text her friend Cindy. So she's writing this letter. And the beauty of Doctor Who, when you read through this, is you get to be the companion. You put yourself in the shoes of the companion and you are, um, it, you can pretend to be in awe, to be so overjoyed at being on another planet of helping people. And oh, I got goosebumps again. I need, is there a color correction so you can see my goosebumps? Probably not. And she she ends up being special, like a, she has a special, like psychic ability connection thingamabobber. See, I even sound like the 10th Doctor, right? <laughs> That's how he uses his terms. Anywho, 
And then it makes, it's fun to pretend like, well, if she's special, I could be special too. What if I was a companion of the doctor and end up, I had some cool special ability that was latent and brought out because I was in the TARDIS, etc., etc. So as I mentioned, no spoilers, just flip into here is a story um, where the weeping angels come back. And of course, in Doctor Who stories, whether it be TV or comics, you got to develop the other people that are the characters as well. So you get to know um, the soldiers and, you know, feel for them and what they're going through. Oh, I'm sorry. This one, this story is the one with the um, the beings that are like sound. I was I was meshing the two together with the first story with the um, the good and bad vibe spirits. Here they are inviting you in. Of course I'll go with you guys. But Gabby, I have to kill you because the doctor is mine alone. That's the agreement my husband and I have. We, whoever kills the other one first, gets to be the companion. So once again, these great um, issue covers and variants of the covers. Oh, look, the author, Nick, he drew one of the covers. That's cool. And then you have um, all of the collections of all the doctors right here listed this was printed in 2017 in july titan comics will be um publishing a 64 page issue of a comic written by dan slott with the 10th doctor and adventure with martha jones and that was the page count the binding um just a little bit of a summary a glance within of the art of this book in the comments below let us know if you have read it um no spoilers please or the question could be who's your favorite companion and why if you enjoyed this video please hit the like it goes a long way and thank you so much for watching supporting and as always stay minty